So in this video I'll be showing you how to add multiple outlines to text. So I'm first making a new document and if you just want a PNG of the text then click on transparent background. I'm adding a fill layer for now just so I can see the text better and I'm changing the colour in the colour studio. Then I'm going to the artistic text tool and I'm tapping on the screen. I'm changing my font and I have made a video on how to download fonts to Affinity so I'll leave that linked in the description. I'm increasing the size and I'm changing the colour to white. Then using the move tool and I've got snapping enabled, I'm centering the text in the page. And if you want to enable snapping, go to document, go to snapping and enable snapping. Then to start adding the outlines, I'm clicking on the text layer in the layers studio. Then I'm going to the layer effects studio. I'm clicking on outline and I'm turning it on. Then I'm increasing my radius so you can start to see the outline. And I'm changing the colour. And it doesn't matter too much right now about choosing the colour because when you've got all the outlines you can go back and change all the colours to have them in the order that you want. So to be able to add multiple outlines, you'll need to group that text layer and then click the little triangle on the side. And you can see that one of them has FX on it and the other one doesn't. And I'm going to rename this one text layer. So then you have the text layer and the group. So click on the one that doesn't have the FX on it, which is the group, and then you can go back to the layer FX studio and add another outline. And because the radius of the last outline was 15 pixels, I'm changing the radius of this one to 15 as well, just so all the outlines will match. And I'm changing the colour. Then go back to the layer studio and I'm going to group that text layer again to be able to add another outline. Then click the triangle, click on group and add another outline. And again I'm changing the radius to 15. And you can just repeat this as much as you want to get all the outlines you want. And I'm going to do it a few more times. So I'm going to the text layer, I'm grouping it, then I'm clicking the triangle, then going to the group and adding another outline. And if this starts to happen where it looks like the text is being cut off, it might just be a glitch, so I found if I go to the move tool and adjust the text, it should go away. I want to add one more outline, so I'm going to the layer studio, I'm going to the text, I'm grouping it, clicking the triangle and then adding the outline. So now that I've got all the outlines, I want to start changing the colours. So I'm in the layer studio and I'm clicking on the top layer. And then I'm clicking on outline so I can see the colours. And the layers will go in the order of the outlines. So the top layer will be the outside outline going down to the bottom layer, which will be the centre outline. So then all you need to do is click on the layer and change the colour. And if you wanted to add any of the other effects, just go to the top group layer. And then you can add anything else that you want. So I'm going to add an outer shadow. And I'm bringing up the offset so the shadow comes out to the side a little bit. And if you just want the text, then you can delete that fill layer and just make sure to save it as a PNG. 